सो वी फाइनली हैव समथिंग डिफरेंट अ डिफरेंट कस्टम होम द नेम इज कैटलिस्ट टू एस एंड आई एम नॉट श्योर इफ मैनी ऑफ यू हैव एवर हेयर ऑफ दिस कस्टम होम येट सो फार बट दिस कस्टम होम इज एक्चुअली क्वाइट इंटरेस्टिंग बिकॉज दिस कस्टम होम येस इंक्लूड सम ऑफ द कस्टमाइजेशन बट विच आर दोज एंड हाउ यू कैन यूज दोज आई टॉक अबाउट ऑल दोज थिंग्स इन दिस वीडियो सो स्टे ट्यून एंड मेक श्योर टू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड First of all, yes, it's based on Android 13. Catalyst OS version is version 1.1, which I'm talking about with November security patch. This custom, room, as far as I know, while making this video, is only available for three devices. So the three devices which are available, I will provide the link for all of those. And other devices might get this very soon, or maybe not. I'm not sure about that. The first of all thing is it does not include Pixel Launcher as expectedly, which based on Quick Step Launcher I think so. So all the features and customizations are same or maybe almost same with other custom homes which are having this custom launcher pre default by this custom launcher by default installed. This was the default UI. Of course, I have enabled a custom icon pack which you can also use, and a lot of free icon pack options are available on Google Play Store. Here comes the quick settings panel. This quick settings panel is actually in dark mode. By the way, this custom home actually focus on stability. And uh, to be honest, as I'm using it from past 24 hours so far, and the performance and stability both are just excellent. It's up to the mark. No bugs, no stutters, nothing at all, and it's super good. Volti, wo Wi-Fi, everything seems to be super good. And the device I'm using right now is Mi 11X. So yes, if you're using that device, go for it. Another change which I found here is the game space. It's not there. So if you're a gamer, you were looking for gaming dashboard, game space. It's not there. So keep this thing in your mind while you're installing this, because if you want those things, those things are not present. One thing was kind of weird, and to be honest, I was not expecting that. The thing is, Volti and Wo Wi-Fi indicators are present, and which are working perfectly fine. I I have tried a lot of custom homes. In some custom homes, if you enable Wo Wi-Fi, the Wo Wi-Fi signal just uh, the Wo Wi-Fi icon just does not disappear. Even if you are using Volti, that Wo Wi-Fi icon still there. So that is kind of a bug which is not present in this custom home. So that's good. We have fingerprint option available. No face unlock. So if you need that, unfortunately, it's not available here for you, including some of the options which includes quick unlock, scramble layout. So if you want to use pin layout, you can. If you want to use pin lock, you can use that. Gestures also having some useful features already, like swipe to screenshot, quick touch, one-handed mode, and etc. etc. We have a three-button navigation which includes the invert navigation bar layout, which is kind of necessary. You can even hide the navigation bar pill if you want to. But if you hide the pill, you will of course hide the space too. But if you want to stay with the pill but hide the space below the keyboard, you can't do that. So that the option named as I M E button space is not present. But that's okay. It's actually having a stock UI stock feel. But I will show you why I am I am saying that this is actually one of the unique custom moves. So I put screenshot is there and here comes some uniqueness. To be honest, that's good. We have these options, and uh, one thing let me tell you, like this performance tuning, these options you can do after root in every custom room. But this custom room is allowing you to do these things without root. As far as I know, as I'm using it, my device is not rooted, and you can customize these things. You don't need to root your device. So this is actually awesome. and i haven't found this thing this kind of thing in any other custom room so far i tried almost every custom room and i did not found this feature in any other custom room so that's actually unique we also have some display customizations which includes enable smart pixels which might be available in other custom rooms too use content detection for refresh rate so this is actually useful this is actually useful for the devices which are having a refresh rate so if your device is already with 60 hertz don't worry it's not usable for you we have status bar customizations which includes reduce heads up which is super useful of course double tap to double tap status bar for sleep shift pixel to prevent screen burn and like that lock screen only having the lock screen charging info but that's also super useful the performance one was super good fingerprint also having the fingerprint unlock animation so if you don't need that you can simply disable this option it's totally up to you last but not the least we have the schedule reboot we have the schedule airplane mode that's good and unlimited google photo storage with unlock higher fps so these are some very great options this is about catalyst os one of the unique customs if you want to install link is there in the description 
Thanks for watching and goodbye.